we will now make some adjustments to our existing levels and create some new levels uh, to be shared th with the rest of the project disciplines. First of all, we can see that level zero is currently reading as minus 19,944. Uh, we are going to change that by selecting the level itself. At the moment, it's reading the project datum, which is our survey, or sorry, our project base point. We will change that to read from the shared datum, which is our survey base point. You can see it now goes back to zero. Um, we will now rename that level, and we will call it our our survey datum and we will change the corresponding view we will go through the same procedure for level 1 we will change its name to ground floor finish floor level we'll call it 0 We must also change the level type to read from our shared datum. It's still reading at 4 meters. We know the finished floor level of the building is 21050, which brings it up to the required level it needs to be. We will now take a copy of that down to our survey, so our project base point. And we will change the name of level 2 to our project datum. And we will change it to read from our project datum. And you see then it reads at 0. If we change our ground floor finish floor level to read from our project datum, it's now reading the correct level above the ground level. Now that we've adjusted all our levels, we will go back into our ground floor, finished floor level. And we see that all the information is there. We are happy that it is correct. And that model is now ready for sharing as our site model. Um, and all other project team members can acquire the coordinates from that.